We recently told you how to reduce your chances of having items stolen from your vehicle. But should you have the misfortune of having items stolen from your home or car, there are steps you can take to try to recover your property. Sergeant Pete Schillings explains. The first thing they should probably do is contact the investigative element that they reported the offense to, such as a burglary or someone stole your car or, something, or stole something out of your car. You would call the uh, detective that would be in charge of that investigation, and that would primarily be where the crime occurred at. If it occurred, if it occurred up north of the, of the river, then it would probably be the North Patrol Station's property, evidence, or property crime section. We often emphasize the importance of recording serial numbers and storing them at a location away from your home. Once again, Sergeant Schillings. The importance of documenting serial numbers on those items that you have in your house, we currently have approximately 300,000 items in our inventory. The only way we were able to locate your item is by serial number uh, or by scratching your social security number back on the back of the item. We used to do that in previous years, but that is the only way we're able to return those items back to their owners. We frequently receive requests by citizens who want to come down and walk through the property and evidence section to see if they can identify their property. As you can imagine, with 300,000 items in storage, many being held as evidence in homicides and other violent crimes, there is no way to accommodate the public without compromising pending court cases. Eventually, Release evidence and unclaimed property is shipped to companies who specialize in auctioning used items. Proceeds from the sale go to the state of Missouri by law. I'm Officer Shelley Gaddis. Have a great and safe week.